What is going on everybody? It is Craig and we are back with movie number 74 in the series for 2024. And as you can see from the thumbnail on this one, it is Quiet Place Day 1. I mean, this could just be the review of me doing this in my hands. Like, I don't know. I, I really don't know how to, how to review this movie because what they showed wasn't bad. And it is a really easy device to build suspension and tension when you have to be very quiet. So I, that's why I appreciated movies like that. Um, but the problem is, like, nothing of note happened. And I guess, like, there were some parts of me trying to remember the Quiet Place sequel. And I think one of the, the guys who is on that other island, he was in this as a secondary character. Um, I could be wrong. You'd have to correct me with that in the comments. But the, the, pretty much the main two characters you followed on out. Uh, you had a woman who was in hospice, so she was dying. Uh, and she sort of got a chance to live out being back in the city, which was a big deal for her. And then you have a guy who essentially popped up out of water, saw her cat, followed her cat, and then just started following her around for a while. And yeah, they developed a, a good relationship. He saved the cat a couple of times, and he actually, yeah, saved the cat several times. But like... And then he risked his life, not only for the cat, he got a medication, went back to the place she gave him her father's jacket. It's all very sentimental and all that, but why'd you care? Like, there was nothing in, there was nothing in the movie, like, you know, like, the characters are what they are. Like, I mean, the actress, the lead actress, I think she did a good job. I think the, the guy who they didn't give a name to until the very end in a note, I think he did a fine job. Well, no, he introduced himself one at a time to her. I think he did fine too, but I didn't care if he lived or died. Like, the, the biggest thing that held the people I was watching with was they loved the animal. It's like, that cat may not die. I'm not watching that movie where that cat dies. That's kind of some of the things I heard. So I am glad the cat didn't die. But there wasn't anything... I don't know. It was very, just very blah. It was, it was shot well. The acting was fine. The creatures are fine. You know, you know, my complaint, a lot of times in movies like that is sometimes it gets too dark. I don't mean too dark like, you know... I don't know, I was going to name a really dark movie, but maybe I shouldn't, shouldn't do that. Um, but I mean too dark, like, with the lighting. So the times you try and see. Also, when they write stuff on a piece of paper and you're supposed to read it real fast. Well, I'm sitting far away from the TV and I'm getting old, so that became harder. But, I don't know, I guess if you like the other Quiet Place movies, this was interesting. I, I, I think it would be better if they had a character that was more involved in the third, have a bigger role. Like, But it was still a, a nice redemption arc for her, I suppose. Like... You know, she was in hospice, and then she got a chance to go back to her apartment and sort of live life, and she was playing music, and then she got plugged in, and, you know, essentially she came to them. But in that regard, she still committed suicide, so it's like, did she really redeem? Like, you could say, oh, she's self actual Well, not self actual right? Uh, she went through the stages, and she's in acceptance. Okay, acceptance doesn't mean you're jumping off the bridge, which is kind of what she did. Actually, it's what she should have done to swim to safety like the other guy did, but I don't know. I... I can't give it a, an under a 5 rating because it doesn't deserve it, but can't really go higher than that either because it just, it just wasn't, it was, it was fine for what it was. So, Quiet Place, day one, we're giving a 5 out of 10. Um, I do know I said Trap was going to be the next movie. I, my Trap will still get to Trap within the 70s, but not just yet. But there you go, movie number 74 in the books, 5 out of 10.